Good morning. I am on the road. I'm headed to Treasure Island, which is near St. Pete Beach, um, Clearwater. It's like all on that strip. So um, I was supposed to be going with some of my family that's here from Kentucky, but unfortunately someone's not feeling well. So they are not able to go today. I'm still making the road trip to go see my Aunt Connie and my Aunt Dawn and my niece Kaylin. Uh, Connie and Dawn are both my mom's sisters and Kaylin is my brother's daughter. So I'm going to go have lunch with them at Caddy's on the Beach and I'm so excited. So I can't wait to show you all around. Treasure Island is like one of my favorite places. Um, it's like one of the closer beaches. To Disney World, of course, Cocoa Beach and like the Melbourne area, those beaches are all the absolute closest because you can get to Cocoa in about 45 minutes. To where we're, uh, where I'm going today is about an hour and a half drive, but it's on the Gulf side and the beaches are so much better in my opinion. I know some people prefer like the beaches over here um, for the waves. Um, but I just like the Gulf beaches. I think they're, the water's like soft and um, the waves are not harsh and the sand is softer. It's just such a beautiful, beautiful place. So I'm on the road and um, we should be there in about an hour. And the I-4 traffic um, that's going in the opposite direction is backed up for miles and miles. Look at that. This is the exit you would take for Legoland. Exit 55, which is someplace we go a lot. Look at this I-4 traffic. It's still going on and on and on. My side is now moving smoothly, but the other side is backed up for miles. Okay, I'm still going. Um, I-4 turns into 275 towards St. Pete. So that's where we're heading. Traffic is still pretty heavy. But hopefully once we get through Tampa, we'll get out of this heavier traffic. Getting closer, we're almost there. on Paradise Boulevard or Paradise Lane. Go right to Paradise Lane, go left to Paradise Boulevard. <laughs> we are in Paradise. I'm almost to where I'm headed to Caddy's on the Beach. Oh my goodness y'all, I don't know how, but I made it. And don't judge me because I got sunglasses over top of my glasses so I can see. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hope I'm not the only one in the world who does that. Look. Boom. Instant sunglasses. But anyway, this is Caddy's. Uh, I do have to tell you that parking is crazy like during this time of year because it's spring break and it gets crowded here. Um, but let's go inside and uh, get some lunch and I'll show you all all around caddy the last time i came here it was only like five dollars to park and they changed it a little bit they don't have like a regular attendant now you have to use this machine and it's cards only you can pay 25 dollars to park for the entire day or it's like six dollars per hour so i just paid the 25 
so that I didn't have to worry about running back out here like like a parking meter. <laughs> but we're here. So this is Taddy's on the beach and it's literally right on the beach, which is fantastic because there's they provide like all this entertainment. You can have they have games, live music, you can rent umbrellas and chairs. Um, the food. Y'all, this is my Aunt Dawn. Hi. This is my Aunt Connie, both Hello. of my mom's sisters. And we're here at Caddy's having a great time. Um, we're gonna eat, we're gonna drink, we're gonna show you all the ocean and everything that's here at Caddy's. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm pretty sure they went to get another drink. We are having Bloody Mary's. This one's almost gone, so she probably went to get a refill. And I'm having the Rum Runners. I think that Caddy's has like the best Rum Runners of any Rum Runner I've ever had. Splitsville's pretty good too. They have good Rum Runners. But just so you all know, my Aunt Dawn is younger than me. She was like a surprise for my grandmas. That's my mom's two sisters. And my brother's daughter, Kaylin, is on her way right now. I wanted to show you all the menu. They have a taco stand, house specialties. They have a steak dinner, fish and chips. I'll probably get the fish and chips. That sounds really good. The crab cake dinner sounds good. They have a shrimp basket, seafood with mac and cheese, a grouper dinner. Market? I don't know. Lots of specialty drinks. The Pineapple Sunrise, the Lucy Goosey, a beach storm. You also can get a whole bucket. Caddy's Gulf Cooler, Coconut Mojito, Banana Cabana! No way! Oh my gosh, I have to order that right now. These are the appetizers and the shareables. They have salads, chowder, handhelds. Uh, they have a chicken quesadilla, chicken sandwich, barbecue, bacon, bacon barbecue burger, cold ranch wrap. So many yummy things. Hi, baby. My niece is here. Hi, Hi baby. Hi, baby. Y'all, this is my uh, server today. Her name's Stephanie down here at Caddy's on the Beach. And she follows me on, on Instagram and YouTube. And she said she doesn't have her Disney annual pass right now because she's not liking the Disney Plus, the Genie Plus system. Boo to that. But she's, she's rocking it down here. She's keeping us up to date. Very hydrated with our rum runners. Thank you, Stephanie. I appreciate it. And maybe I'll see you sometime. Stephanie just brought us our banana cabana. Oh, it's hot. It might have burned me. <laughs> you are crazy. The banana cabana. What kind of nuggets are those? We got some grouper nuggets at Caddy's. Oh my gosh, those look so good. I don't think you can handle it, Caitlin. You sure? You sure? <laughs> All right, what is this even called? It's like watermelon with feta cheese. This is a watermelon bruschetta. I've made it at home, but it's without the bruschetta. Oh my God, it looks delicious. It is delicious. It's watermelon bruschetta. Yum. We also got the fish and chips. It looks so good. This is all from Caddy's. Four be the least you get. Oh! Ahí deberían de tomarlo, no hay que tomarlo. Si me regalo un minuto, regalen un minuto.
and I'll be back for sure. Y'all, this is Caddy's on the Beach. I talk about this place all the time. I love it here. I had to change because now it's getting really cool out here. But hands down, one of my favorite places. The food is great. The view is amazing. The sun is setting right now. I'm getting ready to go have some more food. <laughs> and um, then I'll be heading back to Orlando. So always do what makes you happy and dream big and make sure you all um, come to Caddy sometime if you all get a chance to. And I'll see you real soon from somewhere at Walt Disney World or around the world. chairs and umbrellas here right on the beach and not have to worry about bringing your own um, they also have like toys and stuff for kids they have floats and noodles and everything available I love that there's a bathroom here there's drinks and food you don't have to worry about bringing anything just bring yourself and your sunscreen it's amazing there it goes the big orange ball sinking in the water here at Caddy's in Treasure Island with this beautiful white powder sand. It's amazing. They have so many games here. I love that. They have um, like this Connect Four, Frisbee, basketball, all kinds of different stuff. And there goes the sunset. Oh man, beautiful. I could stay here all day. They also have this huge Olympic size beer pong game. And they also have these custom boards right here for, um, what's that called, cornhole? And they have um, a Connect Four game. They used to have like little places out here where you can have, um, a campfire but those are gone they're not here anymore from the last time i was here but this is caddies on the beach everybody a place you definitely want to try the food is delicious and i love it here 